Hello, this is Heather with Pearly Shell Fiber Arts, and we are starting to go through wheels that I carry here or that people may have questions on. So I thought I would do a little demo today on my Modicraft Rose. This rose is an older model right now. I don't have a new model in stock, I just sold one. Um, but the standard design has not changed very much. These are manufactured in New Zealand out of New Zealand Rimu wood. Um, they are ball bearing driven scotch tension wheels. Um, they are made by a family there and all handcrafted. This wheel is about 10 years old. Um, the only changes I have are placed the drive band. This is a nylon drive band. These have multiple ratios. You can actually use ratio, you can set ratios here. You can also, of course, set your ratio up here. This is the slow speed whorl. There is also a high speed whorl that comes with it. It comes with um, this, uh, the two whorls, two different flyers, one lace flyer and one regular. But on here today, I actually have my Wooly Winder flyer. This is an aftermarket part um, made by Wooly Winder in Oregon. We can assist people with ordering these. These are really great um, pieces of equipment because it speeds things up because it fills my bobbin. I don't have to move a hook. The regular Modricraft has a sliding hook, and also all Modricrafts have what we call an open orifice, which is um, on the regular flyer. It's a V orifice. This one is a um, is a large. This is an art yarn, the bulky woolly winder, so it has the art yarn orifice, and I have it hooked through this at thing here because clearly I am not spinning art yarn. Right now I'm spinning um, lace weight on it. So I'm going to show you guys here how it works for a minute. Just like any other wheel, obviously I treadle. These are double treadles. And you can see it's very smooth. This bobbin does have a new clatter to it. Um, it's got a little bit of a clatter there. But it just spins and as I spin the woolly winder Fills up the bobbin. There are several other Modricraft wheels. Um, I'll be showing these in the coming weeks along with some other wheels as well. Um, <clears throat> if you have specific questions, you can feel free to message us and we will help you out with those. I know buying a spinning wheel is a huge investment and it's something we um, really have to put a lot of thought into. And everybody spins different. There's no one perfect wheel. What Some of the pros to the Modricrafts are the fact that you don't have to oil the wheel. Um, the, this wheel has never been oiled except for a couple of drops on the treadle um, when I spun it in the rain. I had to do that. Um, other, the other things is that they are all signed and numbered, which makes it kind of special. Um, these wheels are, I believe, they're the Maserati. They're smooth, they're fast, and you can do anything from art yarn all the way down to the lace weight spinning on the same wheel, which is a huge thing. Modricraft also sells an overhead <laughs> drive flyer, uh, which you hold up to three pounds of yarn. It's huge. It's really fun. You can fill that up. I'll be showing that one on the Aura wheel, which is another Modricraft wheel um, that we have here. These, the ratios on this are go from very, very slow to very, very fast. I want to say it goes up to about 27 to 1. 29 to 1 without getting the additional high speed head. You can get an additional high speed head and flyer. You can uh, and um, bobbin set. You can also, like I say, get the bulky flyers. They're standard bobbins. Carrot holds about 8 ounces. They're bulky holds a little bit more than that. I'm going to try to fit about 12 ounces onto this one. We'll see how that goes. This one has currently about 5 ounces on it. Um, so you can see, I'll stop here, you can see, and you can see how evenly the woolly winder winds up, I'm going to put you guys back here so you guys can see this action, come back here, one of the other really pretty things about the rose is that it is a beautiful wheel to watch, it has a lot of design features, the Rima wood is only allowed to be used on furniture, they're not allowed to use it in any other type of modification are used there and that um <clears throat> and they it does um make a beautiful wheel it's a softer wood i do polish them with a lavender beeswax polish that actually was developed by modicraft 
uh, when you buy a wheel, I give you a little package of that because it does do a great job on the wood. These wheels are not a travel wheel, except that they do fold down, and I can pick it up one hand, and it has a handle. They also, because they're heavy weighted at the bottom, they don't tend to tip over on the cart, which is a really great feature. So this is the Mazda Croft Rose. Like I say, I'm Heather with Pearly Shell Fiber Arts, and I hope that they answer some of your questions.